morning, good afternoon, good evening. Today we continue with our Know What You Believe series and the title for what we're looking at today is Christians are not perfect doers of the law. Not even Christians can keep the law of God as God demands it to be kept. They still possess the evil nature, the old Adam, and whatever proceeds from this influence is wicked and sinful. The Apostle Paul, a Christian, admitted that he was not yet perfect, but that he was unceasingly striving after that perfection which Christ wanted him to have. Philippians 3 verse 12 or Romans 7 14 through 23 and following. Only as we live in the Spirit shall we walk in the Spirit. Galatians 5 25. All the good works of Christians are tainted with sin because they are more or less contaminated with the selfishness of the flesh and are motivated by servile fear. However, for Jesus' sake, even those imperfect spiritual sacrifices of God's children are acceptable to God. And from 1 Peter 2, verse 5, Ye also, as lively stones, are built up a spiritual house, a holy priesthood, to offer up spiritual sacrifices, acceptable to God by Jesus Christ. So we are not perfect doers of the law because we walk in this life with the new regenerate man and the old man. And we can't in this life ever separate those two to tell which one is active and which one is not at, that, at any given time. So what we have to remember when we think about our not being perfect is that uh, even our best works, this side of heaven with a sinful nature still at work, might be tainted and might not be good but we also see that as God's new creations we ought to always strive uh, to do these things uh, according to God's will and God's plan so just because we can't do these things perfectly we always strive to do them the best that we possibly can and even if they're imperfect we're reminded God still rejoices in these imperfect good works that we attempt to do for the right motives toward others. So it's not a futile thing where we think, oh, since I can't do it perfectly, I don't do it at all. Not an acceptable excuse. Uh, you still strive to live like Jesus lives and to do things as, the, as, as best as you know how in terms of how Jesus wants you to do it. Have a good day.